Pat Love back with Pat's Two Cents. <laughs> this is what I want to say. I love God so much because He's not only real, He's so approachable, He's so understanding, so kind. I would that every one of you could experience God and His love. It made all the difference in my life. I don't know if I would still be walking with him if he had not manifested himself to me. But I did pursue him. I, pers I was on hot pursuit. One of the central core themes of my prayers to him was, God, I don't love you. God, I don't know you, but I want to. I want to connect with you. I want you to be real. I, don't, I want to know you, not just believe in you. Just believing wasn't enough for me. I'm greedy. I want it all. And getting to know God, his tenderness, his understanding. When you get to know God, let me tell you, baby, you can't help but love him. You can't help but want him in your life. You can't help but be grateful for the times he dried your crying eyes and he comforted your hurting heart and he healed those old scars and removed the bitter memories and untied the chains that had you bound. When you experience that from God, I don't care how frustrated you get with him from time to time in your life. The bond never gets broken. Because even though you may not agree with his methods, because you don't get it, you still agree with him. It's... I remember when my parents... I remember when my father, one time he spanked my behind royally. But I knew I was wrong. I knew I was wrong from the get-go. And after his lecture, after the, after the whooping, I got the lecture. And there was no doubt in my mind I was wrong. But do you know I wasn't angry with him for spanking me? And I didn't wonder if he loved me. I didn't think that he would pack his bags and leave because I messed up. So my point in saying all that is when you are truly connected with God, you know beyond a shadow of a doubt he is so for you. Even in the booty whooping of life, he is still for you. Even in your losses and your, your setbacks, he is still for you. If I could just wave a magic wand and help you understand, you would never take a chance of missing out on him. The love, that deep-seated love that we long for before we give our heart to the Lord when we're unsaved, when we're out there searching and getting to know who we are and all of that. When we're on, and you know, when we're a big question mark and life is a big quandary and, and we feel like a lost ship in the ocean. If I could just get you to see how much God is pulling for you and me, even while we're in the middle of our mess. Ah, okay. I'm emotional. 
sometimes when I get through doing these videos, I get so grateful when I think about the goodness of God. And if you only knew how good he was. You know, when he comes and manifests himself in your house or at church or in your car, he brings an atmosphere and it is so beautiful. It is so beautiful. I wish you could all experience it. And I'm sorry that so many of you have not. It is beautiful. There is no high, no sex, no romance, no fun, no money, no nothing that can bypass how beautiful it is to encounter God. Pursue him. I beg you to pursue him with all your heart, your soul, might, your strength. And I promise you, you will find him when you seek him with all your heart.